Today, we embark on a fascinating exploration of Washington quarter dollars struck in the year 1977, originating from the renowned mints of Philadelphia, Denver, and San Francisco. How valuable these coins can be in open market. First of all it's essential to understand the dynamic nature of coin collecting. The value of these coins fluctuates over time, influenced by factors such as condition, rarity, and demand. Nevertheless we will give you some tips throughout this video. Hit that subscribe button and let's get started. The 1977 P. Washington Quarter is widely abundant across most grades, with over 468 million examples struck. Locating them in circulation shouldn't pose much of a challenge, except for those in superior uncirculated condition. Only in MS-66 or higher do they become rare. Achieving MS-67 condition proves exceptionally challenging. Coins grading higher than MS-67 are virtually unheard of and should be cherished, as they are deemed condition census coins. Nearly a half a billion Washington quarters were minted at Philadelphia in 1977, but but very few of them have achieved an MS-68 assessment. According to Heritage Auctions, this specimen displays vibrant pastel patina in shades of gold, lavender, powder blue, sea green, and yellow. It was sold for $1,560. Another MS-68 specimen was showcased at Great Collections Auction in April, 2023. It was sold for $4,612.50 with buyer's fee. The 1977 D. Washington Quarter is a typical date within the series, characterized by its commonality. It becomes somewhat scarce only in MS-66 condition. Any grade below MS-66 is deemed common. In MS-67 condition, there are only a few dozen confirmed graded examples. Coins grading higher than MS-67 should be carefully assessed, as they are considered tough finds in this exceptional condition. This is the finest 1977 D. Washington quarter and it ended up selling for $4,676.62 with buyer's fee. According to Jamie Hernandez from PCGS, the 1977 S. Proof Washington quarter is fairly common and very inexpensive up to PR-69 deep cameo condition. Raw examples can easily be purchased as a single coin, in proof sets or in rolls. Perfect PR70 deep cameo examples are much more difficult to find but with enough searching, you might find a perfect looking example. If not, a graded PR70 example can be easily purchased for a slight premium. But probably the most valuable 1977 Washington quarter is an error variety widely known as transitional alloy error. 1977 D. Washington quarter struck on a silver clad planchet. Simply put, this is one of the most significant mint errors that we have offered in recent sales. Whereas the 1977 D. Washington quarter is a copper nickel clad issue, this piece was erroneously struck on a silver clad, aka 40% silver, planchet used for the sum of the San Francisco mints bicentennial issues of 1976. According to Stax Bowers, this is a pleasing and very rare mint state example, both sides exhibit pale silver tinting to sharply struck, softly lustrous surfaces. It was sold for $12,000. Thank you for joining us on this remarkable exploration of Washington quarter dollars struck in 1977. Until next time, happy collecting!